Well, we're in transition from winter sports to spring sports in the high school area here, but we look one more time back at the State B tournament for the run of the Colfax Bulldogs. They're in this week's Shining Star. If high school is a time to try a wide range of different activities, Colfax's Caleb Berquist is taking advantage. He's a kid that's always encouraging other kids. Like I said, he's a great leader in our school, a uh, great leader uh, on our team. He's very well-rounded, and I think it's important to be involved in as many things as possible. And, and being in a small school, um, you know, that's what the best leaders do. As a starter on the Bulldogs basketball team with a 3.8 GPA, he's also a member of the Honor Society, the Future Farmers of America, and a competitor in Washington's High School Rodeo Association, where he's a state champion. I practice every day at rodeo as well as basketball, and so commitment kind of comes into both. I try to be a leader. Coach Reese needs somebody to get the team going. I try to be there for that, but it, it also goes over to rodeo too. If somebody needs uh, help, that I think I can help them. I try to help them. I'm not saying I'm the best at, at all, but I can uh, try to help them what I've learned. But it was Caleb who needed the support during his sophomore year when he was diagnosed with a bone infection tumor in his leg, putting his million mile an hour lifestyle on pause. It was, a, it was a shock to me when I, when I heard that I was going to have to have two surgeries and I was on crutches for five months and had to have a pick line. But it was hard to overcome that. I mean, it was, it was kind of a scary moment. I didn't know how it was going to end up. I was kind of down. Uh, I didn't know if I was going to be back for the next year's basketball season as well as rodeo. Five months of daily treatment and physical therapy helped Burquist get back onto the court where he happened to hit a game winner in the district tournament to help Colfax get back to state. I'm proud of my team for, I mean, making it this far. We haven't been here in five years, and uh, we're just happy to be here, and it was a fun journey to get here. Memories we won't forget. With this week's shining star, Alyssa Charleston, KXLY4 Sports. Thank you, Alyssa. If you know of a senior student athlete that you believe deserves some recognition, please let us know. Send us an email to sports at KXLY.com. We'll have another shining star next week, Nadine. All right.